first let's go to the solas os website and get some insight about it Uh, Solas is a very popular operating system and it is designed to do everyday home computing and you can do as much tweak as possible to get a greater computing experience and uh, they, are, they have a lots of desktop environment and uh, it is as you can see their website is very polished and it is designed for everyone and Solas provides you the great experience that enable you to most of, of your hardware and uh, as per previous testing I can say that it is a lightweight operating system if you have 2 gigs of RAM and uh, it's uh, looking uh, very good than the XFC desktop and for that uh, if you want to get the ISO you just need to go to the download section and from here you can get uh, ISO for your need they have some great uh, operating systems with great desktop environment uh, in them I downloaded the Solas Baji and uh, you can try Solas Genome, Solas Mate and Solas Plasma as per your requirement and the system requirement for the operating system is 2 gigs of RAM and a 64 bit processor so if you get a guide like how to download it and how to get a operating system running out of the box with plenty of good softwares so now let's uh, run it in the genome boxes I am uh, using genome boxes for the demonstration purposes and uh, for that let's go to create a virtual machine after that uh, you need to get the ISO file I downloaded the ISO file I think in the Arc Linux one yes I think in that volume after that you just need to go to home and okay this one is the Solas Baji edition and hit the create and when you hit the create you can see the uh, uh, booting screen and from here you can wait for some time to boot the operating system in live and I assigned it a 2 gigs of RAM and 4 threads of my CPU and one unique thing about genome boxes is that you can use the whole processor unit like 4 gigs of if you have uh, i3 CPU and 4 thread then you can assign 4 threads to the original machine as you can see that now we have a uh, look now I make it a bit larger so you can get a good view of this operating system now um, uh, it's kind of uh, reminds us the uh, windows like uh, but it's not windows and it also very lightweight and if I open the system monitor then you can see that I assign it to gigs of RAM and it's using 940 MB and uh, if the free quite like 1.1 gigs RAM is free and uh, so I think it's a very lightweight operating system as per like it's uh, running very smoothly and uh, you can get the notification setting like the applets and the other notification and here you can adjust the 
sound and something you want to do here you can lock suspend restart and shut down your operating system and also if you want to uh, like you can here you can like opening uh, like calculator they have a calculator so you can use it uh, let's change some of the uh, wallpaper so it's feel good and one thing you can you get a global dark thing out of the box which is pretty awesome if I opt this dark theme I think it will be changed to light and here you can uh, control all the uh, properties of the operating system and here you can create a new panels you can see that we created a panel so you can do that and if you want to like uh, uh, decrease the size of the panel you can do that and also if you want to get a dock mode you can also get that feel like a mac os or ubuntu dash to dock extension which is a very good extension which i used a lot now um, here you can see that now apart from that uh, let me close the operating let me close that now if i go to the terminal uh, if i go to the terminal let me install the a as new fetch and uh, by default it's so last uses uh, your package file system to install and uh, manipulate the softwares so I think it's a uh, similar to the apt and in Fedora DNF and previously known yum and you can see that and you do it's downloading the neo fetch and I think it uh, it's very fast and I loved its looking like its installation process it is very colorful and it's uh, give you all the information how it is installing it and so you can give it a try like uh, the solas operating system is a very nice operating system to daily uh, daily driver and if you go to like get a feeling about it and it is independent of Ubuntu or something related uh, like Debian it's an independent package or a operating system so new fetch now new fetch give us that you can see that it's currently using the latest 5.10.12.171 current kernel which is uh, really great that you get the latest kernel out of the box and 5.10 is really great I think so if you want to give it a try I think uh, it is the best time to uh, give it a try and if you think that this video is worth your time then give it a like so I can make some great videos about other operating systems and if you think uh, you want to see more videos like that so you can subscribe to my channel and so see you next time and if you have some suggestions you can comment me comment down and also ping me uh, instagram so that's all for today thank you very much see you next time and